What's up, Raze boy? Brawl server, bro. Brawl server. Do you guys do you guys think Indo is a brawl server? I've seen discussions all around here. Like Wolf even said that like Aurora will will beat both our both our representatives, stuff like that, right? We'll we'll react to some clips, okay? Well and then that's the thing, guys, you know? Like in a lot of these games in Indo, a lot of the times it's just a battle of uh, of blunders. A lot of times it's a mistake that the enemy team can capitalize on. Which is still something that's impressive like to, to for, for these teams to capitalize on. But when we saw the PH playoffs at least, I, I'm not talking about day one. Because day one PH playoffs was horrible. right? Day one PH playoffs was basically a brawl region too. Let's be honest here. That's garbage. Like First match, MPL PH was garbage day one. Omega Blacklist was hot garbage. I would say MPL ID matches are still higher level than Blacklist Omega. Because that shit's garbage. But I would say MPL PH as a whole in the playoffs... I was definitely more impressed with the plays that they were making with the forced errors as well. Because even here, it's just like, what's going on? Right? Lost a turret. Super Luke is freaking 1 HP. I mean, it's weird. It's just weird. Like, there's so... Yeah, there are a lot of brawls that are just unnecessary and stupid. I agree. Let's talk about Game 7. RQ versus TLID, though. I'll be honest with you guys, all right? I'll be level with you guys. I don't know if other streamers have said this too, but Game 1, 2, 3 of Grand Finals MPL ID was bad. After casting Game 3, I was visibly irritated. I looked visibly irritated. I didn't show in the broadcast, obviously, and none of you guys, you know, none of you guys probably realized that I was annoyed. But Realize and Arashi, they looked to me after Game 3, and I just had a, a pretty irritated look. I, I just looked angry. They thought maybe they made a mistake, maybe, you know, the cast wasn't that good or something. So they asked me, Oh, what's wrong, Miracle? And I told them, bro, this is freaking horrible. This is a bad Grand Finals. Because game one to three was just a blunder battle. It was like, who fucked up more? You know, game one to three. It was just a battle over a battle over a battle. But in game... Cause, okay, don't, don't get me wrong here. Game four to seven was also a lot of battles. But in game four to seven, there were a lot of forced errors still. There were a lot of like, high-level plays that I was still... That I'm happy with, at least, you know? I'm, I'm happy. Because when I'm... Game one to three, the, the context is for me, every time I cast an MPID Grand Finals, I look at those two teams and I think, all right, they're going to be our representatives. I have, I don't care if they, if who, like whoever wins, I don't care. It's just these two teams will represent us in M series. So I take a look at the Grand Finals and I have to see good gameplay. If I see game good gameplay, I'll be super happy because again, I'll see the chance of us making it to M6 and doing well in M6 to be pretty high. But game one to three, I literally told them, if this is how we play, we are fucked. In the, we, are, we are straight up garbage. If, if it's just one to three. But after one to three, I think one to three was more of like a warm up. They warmed up and they, they, they had a, a hor horrible three games. Game four to seven was better. I wouldn't say it's world class, absolute cinema level just yet, but it's better. And I'm willing to take that and say, you know what? There are a lot of rookies in both these teams. I think there's still a lot of time between MPL ID playoffs, grand finals, to M6. So like in that time, I think they'll be able to improve a lot and they'll be world-class by M6. But game one to three, there was no cinema about game one to three.